Peace to the family. Soul Consciousness TV. We back. Got King Norma. He's back with another powerful presentation. What's going on, my brother? Peace, peace, family. Today, we're going to continue on with a little more spirit science. And um, today's lecture is going to be on what's the purpose of us coming to Earth? Why do we come to Earth? And why do we come to Earth school? So, let's get started. A lot of people wonder, why do we come to Earth? Why do we have to go through Earth school? What is the person, like what is the purpose of, uh, of a person having to come to Earth school and having to reincarnate and come back down again as a continuum to keep going through the life lessons and deal with the challenges and, 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 and different gifts that we are, 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 are blessed with or ordained with when we come through, you know, the 12 houses would and would not. A lot of people believe in reincarnation. A lot of people believe in multiple lives and different spiritualities, religions, and cultures. They all believe in reincarnation or multiple lives. And knowing that we have more than one life, we also know that we have more than one planet, which means we have more than one galaxy, universe, and dimension. Earth is like a school. Being that it is a school, we come down here to learn our life lessons. We all have gifts and challenges. To grasp some of your gifts and challenges, the strongest way would be astrology, learning your natal birth chart, studying the 12 houses, knowing your ascending, rising, or sun sign, and knowing your moon sign to better understand your yin and yang. Other powerful forms can be numerology and the tarot, or tarot cards. These are some of the best and easiest forms of divination. Also, predictive sciences to connect with your higher self. In school, you have your gifts and challenges. You might be good in English, writing, and literature, but you might be challenged in science, in world history, and possibly mathematics. We must all learn the elements in life, which is why we go to elementary school, to get the basic tools in life. A definition of education can be derived from the Latin, meaning edu meaning educarde, and that means to bring out the best out of someone. So if we're not bringing out the best in our children, then we're not educating them. But before then, we must first go and plant the seed, which is why we go to kindergarten, because you have to plant the seed in the garden. After elementary school and middle school, we then go to high school to attain the higher sciences and the higher elements. So high school has four grades, which can correspond to the four physical elements or can represent the four elements. You then go to college to obtain a master's degree and then become a master of the universe or of that university. And this is my basic explanation of why we come to Earth School. And with that being said, I want Brother Kufu Shabazz to kind of focus in on the 12 houses and the natal birth charts so that way you can see what your life purpose is, the tools, that, the tools and the characteristics that you've been provided with and what you must do in order to have a good reincarnation in this life and not have to repeat that same life lesson in the next reincarnation. And remember, you have a ascending sign, which is your sun sign, and you have your moon sign. And to find your moon sign is quite simple. It is off by three degrees, but you can simply just put in your birth date, the time you were born, and that will basically from your, 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 your ascending sign or from your sun sign will calculate three degrees what your moon sign is. And that will help better give you your yin and your yang and the total opposite or the polarity of your personality. And that basically is the spirit of science I wanted to drop today on while we come to Earth School. So if there's nothing else, I'm going to let Brother Kuf Shabazz take it back over. But please pay attention to this natal birth chart. If you can, please look it up.
All right, yeah. Peace to the family. Uh, like and subscribe to the channel. And uh, we'll be back next week with more content. Thank you.